if you want to see the transformation of the hair that's the short hair from this to this please keep watching <laughs> So first we'll be using this black rubber band to help style the hair because her hair is really short and the reason why the rubber band is looking this way is because i actually applied hair cream on it so that's why it's looking this way it's because i do not want it to be difficult for her to take off the rubber band i want it to be easy for her to take off the rubber band so that's why i actually applied hair cream on it and that's why the rubber bands are looking this way since it's a short hair and i do know for the fact that it will be difficult for me to pack her hair or style her hair into ponytail and first sectioning her hair into four different portions so that i can easily work my way into slicking or laying the hair flat and also so that i can be able to pack her hair into a ponytail so that's why i actually sectioned it into four different portions so after sectioning the hair into four different portions i'm using the rubber band that i already put inside or i applied um hair cream on i'm using it to kind of secure it so yeah this is what it should look like after sectioning it so now i'm applying the petals gel gradually this is what i usually use this petal gel you guys already know if you're an og you already know that i love using petals gel to style my client's hair especially when they want me to use gel or maybe when they are doing like ponytail so i use this petals gel it's really affordable then after applying the gel i'm using this brush to smoothen it but before that i used a small comb to kind of comb it so that all the so that the gel can actually penetrate down before i go ahead to use this brush to further smoothen the hair and then after that we go ahead to use the rubber band to secure it like so so yeah we'll just go ahead to do the same on the other part of the hair or the rest part of the hair hi everyone welcome back again to the channel thank you so much for tuning in into today's video hope you guys are staying safe today hope everyone is doing great today please if you are new here just go ahead to click the subscribe button to join the family and so that you don't get to miss any notification anytime i upload a new video here on this channel also give this video a big thumbs up if it's helpful share the video to friends and family including loved ones then leave a comment in the comment section of what you think about this video we'd like to see your comment for this video i'll advise you to watch from the beginning to the end so that you don't get to miss any single step because every step counts so, so yeah this is what it should look like after you are done applying gel and smoothening the hair or laying down the hair this is what it should look like so for the next step you will need a needle and a thread extension or attachment you need about one pack of the extension but for me i'm using two different colors so i'm using like half black color one and half 27 that's gold color so i just want to combine them together so i went on to cut the hair into two using the scissors to do so and i didn't fed out the tips of the or the ends of the hair so yeah i just went ahead to start styling the hair and again i didn't combine the two extensions that's the two colors the two colored extensions i didn't combine them together because i do want to have like this mixed look and after cutting the extension i went on to like brush the hair so that it will give me this neat look and before brushing the hair i actually apply hair cream just to further smoothen the hair before brushing the hair Moving on, I'm actually using thread to kind of style the extension first. So now I just want to combine the hair together but not mix them, just to combine them to just start styling it. And yeah, you'll be needing someone to help you do this, this particular part but if you don't have someone, I think you can maneuver your way through doing this part. But yeah, she's actually helping me to hold the other end of the hair while I kind of style the extension first before um, arranging it on her hair. Okay, now the first thing you need to do after combining the two colors together, the first thing you need to do is to take like one end or close to the end of the extension and then use thread to kind of tie it tie it round and make sure it's well secured or 
tight film before using the scissors to cut the excess thread. After doing the first tying, you use both your index finger and your thumb to measure the next, the next part or measure the extension before you go ahead to tie the second. This is very important. This will determine how the style is going to come out or look. So yeah, just use your index finger and your thumb to measure and then use thread to tie that for the second part. Tie the extension very firm and before doing that, after measuring, you go ahead to use a brush first to smoothen it first before you tie with, with thread. This is so that the hair will actually come out neat and so that when styling, it wouldn't look rough when styling. After measuring, you just go ahead to tie that part. This is so that the hair or all the bunch will actually be equal. So yeah, we'll continue. After tying that, we'll measure again. Measure the next, that's the third tying. We'll measure it before I tie. So we continue that way until I get to the very end or the tip of the hair. Yeah, apart from this style I'm about to show you, you can also use this. You can also use this or this method to actually style different or create different looks or with this especially brighter hairs you can use this method to create brighter hairs so yeah just pay full attention to see how i'm going to like maneuver or pave my way into styling this hair this hairstyle was actually requested many like many of you i've been getting lots of requests both on my email and my dm on instagram i've been getting requests on this hair i won't lie i didn't know how to do the hair initially i had to consult one of my hairstylist friends she's in kaduna so i'm going to also as well leave the name of her saloon in the description box below so she actually put me through into knowing how to make this hair so you guys if you are staying in kaduna and you're looking for a very good hairstylist or you're looking for a salon where you can make your hair you can just go ahead to like send her a message her details will be in the description box or so just go and support her ministry so yeah this is what it should look like after tying so you have to get the same results just try to get the same results Okay, before I start placing the extension, we like to first use needle and thread to just kind of bring all the tips of our hair together because they are really short so that they can actually be close to each other before I start attaching the extension because I do not want to attach the extension and then find one of the tips somewhere. So I'm using needle to just bring them together first. So first, we take the extension and then push needle and thread through the extension first before pushing the needle and thread through her hair this is so that it will be easy for me to like secure the extension onto her head first and while securing we'll make sure it's actually firm before i start folding the remaining part of the extension now we we'll just take the first part and fold it like so then we we'll just start securing it at this point i'm going to allow you guys to carefully watch these parts so that you get a better view and also get a better understanding and see how i'm actually securing it like using needle and thread to secure it so yeah
okay here is the final look thank you so much for watching this video to the end hope it's helpful hope you're able to learn something new from this video please if you did do not forget to share the video to family friends and loved ones subscribe if you are new here also leave a comment i want to see i want to know what you guys think about this hairstyle and if you in case if you have any hairstyle you want me to film about you want the detail tutorial on that i'm sure going to like film a video for i'm sure going to film a video on it also give this video a big thumbs up and i will talk to you guys in my next video stay blessed and stay safe as well bye